Alrighty, happy Monday afternoon. Your full weather forecast brought to you by Scott's Recreation, New England's largest trailer dealer, home of Maine's lowest camper and tractor prices, with locations in Turner, Manchester, Herman, and Orono, Maine. Already, clouds have been the theme this morning to the afternoon period. We'll get these clouds out of here, revealing plenty of sunshine and maybe the isolated chance for a shower or storm. Further off toward the north, though, I think most of us will stay dry this afternoon, too. But we're going to be watching another system that will be moving in right about in here. A couple systems we have our eye on, but both of these will be tracking off towards the east. Now they'll equal more showers and thunderstorms that will be on the way by tomorrow afternoon. Today, though, and tonight will be calm, but tonight the concern will then switch over to a little bit of fog. Water temperatures, if you're thinking about going to the ocean today because the air temperatures are warm, but currently in the 60s right now, so not too bad out there. It's a little bit cool in a few areas, so the water temperatures are a lot warmer further down toward the south. But moving forward, though, air temperatures are average high as 81 degrees. We'll be in the upper 80s today, lower to middle 80s Tuesday and Wednesday. Lower 90s, a warm one on Thursday, back down to the upper 70s Friday. Then 80s on the way again as we head towards Saturday and again for your Sunday. Dew points are going to be up and down, but it's going to feel muggy again this week, though, with dew points on making to the 70s possibly as we head towards Tuesday before we fall back down by Wednesday. Then rising again for sure Thursday and Friday, close to that 70 degree mark again, falling back down later on Friday. Then back up again as we head towards Saturday. So a roller coaster ride in the dew point department will be taking place. UV index forecast for today will be at an 8 that's considered very high, a burn time of around 15 minutes. So hats, sunglasses, sunscreen, and shade will be necessary as you do head out the door to avoid a bad sunburn. Moving forward, though, the clouds are getting out of here, and now we're allowing a lot of sunshine, maybe a few passing clouds, and an isolated chance for a shower or storm farther off toward the north. Will remain mostly clear later tonight with a lot of dense fog moving in, so make sure to keep an eye on that. That fog will get out of here as the day progresses on Tuesday. Showers and thunderstorms develop Tuesday afternoon. We'll get that system through, then things will start to calm down late Tuesday night and the parts of Wednesday morning as we get those out of here. And we definitely need the precipitation, too. It's been real, rather dry around here recently with many areas and droughts, so any rainfall will definitely be welcome. So your forecast for today, upper 80s, partly cloudy and warm with that south wind getting up to about 20 miles per hour. Later on site, middle 60s, mostly clear with areas of dense fog as well, and the wind overall looking nice and calm. For tomorrow, scattered showers and thunderstorms, highs in the lower 80s on south wind getting up to about 25 miles per hour. Scott's Recreation extended forecast, mostly sunny on Wednesday, highs in the middle 80s getting hot on Thursday, partly cloudy, highs in the low 90s and upper 70s on Friday with a chance for showers and thunderstorms again.